In previous lecture, we learned about fixed assets, insurance and maintenance. In this, we will learn about fixed assets reclassifications. We will learn how to combine and split fixed assets. For this, I have prepared three new fixed assets. One is production line and two others are two machines. So we will split production line into two machines. So the system will transfer the values into those, those two fixed assets. First of all, we can check our production line number one. We have a book value of 100,000 in two machines. We have a book value of zero. We don't have any entries there. To do the reclassification, we need to have all those three fixed assets ready before we prepare the journal. To create the split, we need to open reclassification journals. We have to put posting date and some document date. Then we put fixed asset number we want to split and in new FA number we put the target fixed asset. We can put the values here so we can put 50% and tell the system what kind of amounts need to be transferred. We, we need acquisition costs. We don't have depreciation yet, so we don't need to move it. If we want to put balancing account automatically, we need to mark this option. In this case, system will move 50% of acquisition cost from this fixed asset into this one. In the second line, I can prepare the rest of the values. So from the same fixed asset, we will move the values into machine number two with 50%. We can of course move not, not full 100%. We can leave some values on existing one. Okay, now we can reclassify it. After this transaction, system prepared GL, FAGL entries that needs to be posted in order to make the posting on accounts. Let's post it. Now we can check on fixed assets, what has changed. When I open our production line, we have a book value of zero. In details, we have our acquisition cost and then two decreases, our reclassifications. In machines, we will find 50,000 as a book value and the source is our reclassification. in the second machine as well. So now let's make the opposite operation. Let's prepare new fixed asset. Let's call it production line two. It is tangible with machinery on production. In this case, we will combine our two machines into our new production line. For this, we will also use reclassification journals, some posting date, document number, zero 03, and in this case, we will use machine as a source and the new fixed asset number will be production line number two. 
in the second line I will use machine 2 as a fixed asset and as a new our production line second in percentage we need to put whole 100 percent to move all the values into our new fixed asset okay let's register those entries okay let's go to our fixed asset GL journals to post values in GL okay now let's check our fixed assets now we have our production line with 100,000 value our two reclassifications and on machines we have a book value of zero.